there, it's Karen Lebo with VintageDazzle.etsy.com and I am here to do another unboxing of the mystery boxes that I got from my sisters-in-law. Um, these uh, were given to me when we all visited my mother-in-law for her 90th birthday and I just filled up my car, brought them home and I really don't know too much about what's in them. So, um, we're just going to delve into them together. I've already done a couple of the boxes and I have, oh, I don't know, three or four more to go after this one. So, ooh, there's a cat right there, but you can't see her. Hi. So, I'm going to show you the what the box looks like first, and then we'll get going. That is the box. It's a banana box. Interesting. And we see right on top. There's these boxes, by the way, they're, it's mostly vintage, and it's a lot of textiles, sometimes it's jewelry, sometimes I see there's a little doll in there. Um, a lot of it are things that my sisters-in-law collected in their many, many travels. They have been all over the frickin' world. They have gone, they've done so much traveling. So, we have a shirt. Say button down the front shirt. Oh, this is quite, quite pretty. A lot of this clothing I would wear, except that I think you have to iron it, and I am the world's worst when it comes to procrastinating about ironing. Stop. Climb the rug. But this is really beautiful. Uh, I'm guessing these are like, um, they look kind of like peacocks. I'm guessing this is Asian. Let's see. Oh, no. There's not. There's just a little size tag. It looks like it says. It looks like it says you. That's not very helpful. Um, yeah. I don't know, but I'm guessing this is Asian. Oh, that's beautiful. Okay, we have some dolls. This is new and different. Look at this. Little doll with fruit on her head. Um, this looks. Central American to me. I'm thinking this is Guatemalan, but I really don't know. I'll have to do a little research. Isn't she cute? She looks like she's carved from coconut shell or something. And we have another one. This one has a baby. Oh, look at the baby. Isn't that cute? Does the other one have a baby? Oh, she does too. They both have babies and fruit on their head. And these, you can see that these are beautiful woven little pieces, little shawls. Oh, aren't those adorable? Oh my goodness. Okay, let's see. This appears to be something ceramic. Oh, this is mid-century pottery. Um, it is, oh. Well, something where Oh, it's Franciscan ware. It's the pink Franciscan ware. That's pretty. There's something in here, too. That's a neat little gravy boat. That's very nice. And, let's see what this is. Oh, look. It seems to be a tiny little salt and or pepper shaker. I'm guessing that's Franciscan also. Yeah, it is. Oh, how sweet is that? I'm, I'm really not familiar. You know, I know there's some Franciscan ware like the Starburst pattern that does really, really well. Uh, and then there's some like the Desert Rose is not selling very well anymore because it's, there's just so much of it out there. Um, I'm hoping the other little salt and pepper shaker is somewhere. We have some more pottery. Ooh, now that's beautiful. And not marked. I do not recognize that. If anybody has any ideas, I'm open to suggestions. But it looks like there might be a few of them in here. Alright, I can't get to the others. 
This looks like another gravy boat. How many Franciscan gravy boats does one person need? But it looks like maybe <laughs> there's a white one. And it's also marked Franciscan. There's the mark. There's a little piece of gravy on that one. Um, you know, it's in good condition. Okay. Could it be jewelry? Aww. Okay, so this is Fantasy Florentine Firenze Italia. So that would be Florence. It is a pin. Uh, enamel, I guess, and leather. That's a really interesting thing. Uh, here, let me <laughs> show it to you better. Um, hmm. Yeah, I don't know anything about that. But it's always nice when there's a label that identifies it, so at least I have somewhere to start with research. Don't know where to go next. <sighs> okay. Lots of ceramics in this bowl. In this one. So, look. Aww. Sweet. Franciscan. Yeah. Made in USA. So we have some pink, some yellow, and some white. It looks like there's a lot of this in here. Maybe I won't open every single one if I can tell what it is. But I love, oh, I love all the different colors. Check this out. Green one. And this one's not marked. Isn't that pretty? Huh, I'm going to run out of room to put all this stuff. Okay, let's see. That's another white one. Just, there's a whole little nest of these. There's another a pink one. So we have yellow, green, white, and pink cuffs so far. Oh, a blue one. Look at that. Well, this is fun. All oh, this a whole rainbow of these colors. What a neat set. I wonder if you could microwave these. Probably not. If you could, I would keep them because they're beautiful. And that is. Well, we have like a cream and a yellow. Okay. Everything's wedged in here. I can't get anything out. Try this. Betting this is more Franciscan. Yep. And it's a vase in the yellow. Ugh. I really like this. I didn't know that I liked this so much. I'm sure I've seen it before. Okay, and another uh, pink. Two pink cups. I'm wondering if these ones that aren't marked at all are older. I don't know. What's this? Ah, oh, look, it's a neat, it's an antique bottle. It would have had a muffin. That's that's a clothespin. Don't eat that. <laughs> Why is it? Why do cats do this? She hasn't. She's been avoiding me all day, and as soon as I start doing something like this that doesn't involve her, she's going to go after me. This says Pepto Mangan Cute Good Cute uh, 
contents in fluid ounces. Con oh, sorry, contents 11 fluid ounces. That's a really neat bottle. I'll have to find out more about that. I mean, most of these bottles are not valuable, but, you know, there's some out there that are. Okay, it looks like we have a whole bunch of the Franciscan saucers, too. So, I'm not going to get every single one, but it looks like they're all in different colors. Yeah, yellow. Oh, look, there's a different color. There's a color I haven't seen yet. Look at that color, maroon. Purple. Ooh, that's nice. Yeah. I just got a peek. That's a blue one and another pink one. believe how everything is stuck in here. She really packed this well. And here is another one of these. Not marked. Now I can get some okay, there's a whole bunch of these um, purple cups in here. Franciscan plates, like dinner plates. That's what they look like. Yep. There they are. It looks like we have a bunch of different colors of those, too. Okay. Let's get back in. Ugh, bug. Ugh, bug. Go away. Um, looks like there's just a ton of the luncheon size plates. And it looks like these are all in different colors too. Home decor function. There's window panels. Okay, that's nothing to do with that. Uh, okay. So it looks like I got about maybe 10 of the luncheon size plates. So, yeah, that's a lot of stuff. So I'm going to pack all this back up, put it back in the box, and then I'll get another box to look at. So I'll be right back. Okay, so here is the next box so I'm going to go through. You know, I can see there's stuff in here. It looks like more Franciscan dishes and... Uh, I know there's a Levi's jean jacket, at least one, in here. So, oh, so we have more, more Franciscan dishes. A Ralph's coupon, I don't know where that came from. A um, piece of cardboard. Here is, oh, it's a vest. We have a Levi's. This is a women's. Mm, size 34, 0213 long. I know there's a way you can research these, the numbers and the styles and stuff, but that's pretty cute. This will be cute, like, oh, you could decorate this with brooches or pins of some kind. Just, that would be really cute. All right, well, I know nothing about that, but... Uh, this one's chipped. That's too bad because it's a lid. Doesn't, sh well, shows a little bit from the top side. That's too bad. Because it looks like it's a big covered dish and those kind, you know, usually sell better. So, I think 
just about everything else in here is going to be the Franciscan pottery. Okay, this is like a, a bowl, a kind of a small, maybe a small serving bowl. And here's the, the dish that the lid goes with. It says CMB, GMB, made in USA. Looks the same as those Franciscan dishes, so I don't know. Um, okay, we've got another big bowl, unmarked. Pink. And an absolutely giant bowl. This also says GMB. Hmm. I'll have to do a little research on that. And then, oh my goodness, we have another huge stack of dinner plates. <laughs> All different colors. We've got white and pink and maroon and cream and yellow. Yeah, I'm, I'm, they're all wrapped up, so I'm not going to take them out. But you, you get the idea. Okay, well, that box didn't take long, did it? Okay, um, I'm going to put all this away and get another box. Okay, so another box I'm just not even going to get into because it looks like it's all Franciscan pottery. I had no idea she was giving me all this pottery. What am I going to do with it all? Um, so, um, I've got this other box that looks like it's no pottery. It looks like it's all clothing, textiles, and this one. Did I show you this before? Because I feel like maybe it was in another box and I just didn't get it upstairs. But it's a, I believe it's a listener. I know I've seen it before. Yeah, it's a listener. It's just stunning. Really pretty pink rhinestones and what do you think? Yeah, that's a pretty piece. Um, okay, what do we have here? Oh my god. Oh, I know. She told me that this was a um, Southern India dance costume. Oh, God, is it wrinkled? Well, that's going to be fun to iron. <laughs> Again, an area I know nothing about. But here's another piece of it, obviously. I have no, this looks like it might, I have no idea, around the hips maybe? Yeah, maybe. Okay. This is a uh, silk eye cat fabric. I've got a piece of that back here behind me. Isn't that lovely? Oh, that's so pretty. It comes from Asia somewhere because it's got elephants on it. Okay. And looks like a linen tablecloth with embroidery and applique. Okay. Well, isn't that pretty? Look at that. That's beautiful. Eyelet work, scalloped edges. Looks like it's in perfect condition. Of course, I haven't looked at every inch of it yet, but 
it looks like it's not been more, um, used. Here is a Stylo Jenna Road Keta. Um, I don't know what this is uh, other than I think it's from India because it's got that mirror work which has a name. Huh. Well, this is like, it's like a little pouch, but it doesn't have um, a, any fastener or strap or anything, so I'm not sure how you use it. Another piece of iCap fabric. This is a smaller piece, but lovely. Look at the colors on that. The little people. Wow, that's so pretty. That is super fine weaving. Wow. Okay. sort of thing. That looks like it's, I'm guessing Asian. You can see there's the very, very fine cross stitch on there. Another piece that's going to be a lot of fun to iron, but looks like it's in good condition. This is more of the dance costume. Oh, okay. That's the shirt. That's the back of the shirt. I don't know. No, that looks like maybe the front of the shirt. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> she finds the oddest things. These, all these textiles, I think, are from Amelia. And is this a Lord and Taylor box? Ah, look at that. Isn't that just the sweetest? It's kind of, um, it's kind of got a moon glow look to it. Very large, figural, articulated, plastic, acrylic, brooch. It's, uh, no marks on it at all. That's sweet, though. I wonder if it really came for Lord and Taylor. I doubt it. Probably just a convenient box. Okay. That's it for that one, and I think I'm going to quit for now. I have one very large tub left, and we'll save that for another day. Thanks so much. Uh, if you are interested in any of these things, please let me know. Uh, I have email addresses below, or you can leave a comment and I'll try and give you information. And uh, I, I can't promise when these will be listed in my Etsy shop, but if you have a particular interest in something, I can put it at the top of the list and get it listed for you if, uh, if that's what you prefer to do. And uh, my shop is vintagedazzled.etsy.com. And I will see you again soon. Okay, thanks. Bye.